Okay, in this short video, I want to show you a little advanced trick of the spot removal tool. In this image, I want to remove the girl here from the background to make it nice and uniform. And you may already know that in Lightroom 5, you can now use the spot removal tool as a brush. So I can actually activate the spot removal tool and then brush over this area. So it doesn't need to be a circle anymore. It can be a freeform selection. And Lightroom will automatically pick up what it thinks to be good donor material. And it actually did a pretty good job. If I press the H key to hide the outlines of my selection, I see it's done a great job. But there is, for example, over here and over here towards the edges, even at a feather setting of 100, it's not ideal. You still see some seams. Now, the problem is that if I would want to paint another adjustment, another brush stroke on top of it, I can't because as soon as I move into the boundary of my brush spot, Lightroom thinks I want to move it. So the trick is to just draw a brush spot that is the size and the shape of the one you want to remove, but to draw it outside of the area, outside of the previous brush spot, and then reposition it. For example, I want to take care of this here, so what I will do is I will decrease my brush and paint something like this. Lightroom will pick up donor material and then what I will do is I will move my new spot to where I want it to be. So I will move it on top of the existing one and that you can do. For some reason you cannot directly draw a brush spot on top of an existing brush spot but you can move one on top of another one. And so I could do the same thing over here with this seam for example over here. I will draw a correcting brush spot next to it, just outside of the frame, and then move it into place. And as you can see, this now effectively has hidden that seam over here. And I can even play with the opacity to eliminate the seams even more. So that was it, just a quick tip on how you can do some kind of content-aware fill inside of Lightroom.